Hello everyone and welcome to Sources Classes. So in this video again we will be continuing our discussion with respect to the question we see in the test of mathematics. So what our intention to as far as the uh, video would be to try and identify the questions that are being asked in this kind of examinations in general and also to get a general idea of the approach involved for solving the question correctly. So having said all of that let's focus on the question at hand. Let P be the point of intersection of the line AX plus BY minus A equal to 0 and BX minus A by plus B equal to 0. A circle with center 1 comma 0 passes through P, the tangent to the circle at P meets the X axis at point D comma 0, then the value of D is, so we need to find the value of D. Okay. So let's take the two equations, AX plus BY minus A equal to 0, let this be 1 and bx minus ay plus b equal to 0, let this be 2, okay? Now, let's do one thing, 1 into a plus 2 into b. Let's uh, do this operation. So, what we get is a square minus ay. So, we get a square <coughs> square x equal to a square minus b square. Yeah, a square minus b square. Therefore, x can be given by a square minus b square by a square plus b square. Now, again, ax plus by minus a equal to 0. So, if you put the value of the same here, so that is a, a square minus b square by a square plus b square minus a plus by equal to 0. So, therefore, by can be written as minus twice a b square by A square plus B square. We can write that. So again, one B gets cancelled. So therefore, Y can be written as minus twice A B by A square plus B square. Okay. So this is what we actually have. Now, if slope of normal at P. If we try to find the same, it can be given as minus twice AB by A square plus B square. Okay. This entire thing divided by A square minus B square by A square plus B square minus 1. Okay. If we further simplify the same, it can simply be given as a by b. So, therefore, slope of the tangent will be minus b by a because the product of the same is minus 1. So, therefore, equation of the tangent at p can be simply given as y plus 2ab by a square plus b square equal to minus b by ax minus a square minus b square by a square plus b square. Okay, so this is what we have. And if we put y equal to 0. So, therefore, what we have is x equal to minus 1. So, therefore, option C is our answer. Okay. So, this was a very simple question in general. Just a few uh, intricate details regarding the 
the finding of the x coordinates or y coordinates and just knowing a constant behind the slope and tangent that was required. So, in case you have any kind of difficulty in trying to figure out how we went about the same, I suggest you go through the video on your own and as many times as you feel comfortable enough to have understood the concept and the process of the solution. And also, having said that, I suggest you try and solve this question on your own with the video as a reference so as to get a better understanding on the approach itself. So, if you like the video, make sure like, share, and subscribe to the channel so that you keep coming up with relevant content such as this for the top of the line as well. And having said that, I'd like to wind up the video and I'm signing out. Thank you so much.